Look at this place, man. It's sad. It suits me. At least put some things up on the wall or get a dog or, or get a goldfish. Or, or, I don't know. For season four, it's a perfect time for Easy to get a dog because he's alone. When you have an animal, especially a dog, and I'm a huge dog person, they're just they're so loving, so giving. My name is Esther Murphy, and I am the animal trainer for this lovely little lady who plays Sally on my end. Sally, huh? Yeah, he's got a dog. When we got all this hardness around you, me, just as an actor, I go home and after I've had a crazy day at work, I see my dogs and boom, it's gone. Instantly, it is gone. I'm glad he's got the dog. I hope the dog just eats this entire trailer, just devours it. I think definitely for the show also, that the pit bull is a perfect metaphorical dog for Easy because it kind of depicts who a lot of the club members are, right? We have this tough looking exterior. We all got a bad rap. But hey man, we're all softies on the inside. Easy has a pit bull, and I think that it really serves and it, it says a lot. Look, Easy is an ex-con and pit bulls get a, a bad rap. It just fits. Her name is really Princess. She came to us in 2015. She was a rescue. When I get calls that they want the pit bull behind the fence, hitting the end of the chain and barking and snarling, and I'm like, you need a different dog for that. That's not her forte. She's just not that kind of dog. Elgin had called me up and he told me that Easy was gonna get a new love interest and that it was a pit bull named Sally. Action. I think he's probably feels like he's a bit of a rescue. You know, you look at a pit bull, and yeah, they've taken a bad rap, man. But unless you've had a pit bull lick your face and try to jump on your lap like a damn chihuahua, you don't know the love that a pit bull has. And all they want to do is be next to you. She's much more aware of all the sounds and everything right now. That's because her belly is getting very full. So now she has uh, time to pay attention to other things in her stomach. Right. So it's it's interesting working with animals. I love it. I absolutely love working with animals because there's they can be very unpredictable. Look, you can train them all day long, but sometimes like they hear noise and they want to turn. Or she's so trained to hit the mark to tell the story. He was just such a natural with her. It seems to me like they just sort of established an instant rapport. Uh, no. Good. 